still like awake, but you could tell she was scared and in shock. A dangerous night at Sunset Cliffs. A woman fell from the cliffs to the beach below. Then two men were pulled from the water. Good evening, I'm Kimberly Hunt. And 10 News reporter Laura Acevedo shows us these rescues come after pleas to shut down the cliffs due to large crowds. Last week, City Council member Jennifer Campbell called for the cliffs to close due to the large crowds gathering, oftentimes not following social distancing orders. The first rescue happened just before 6 Tuesday evening. A 23-year-old woman falling from a cliff at Ladera Park. We just see her like just a body just fall. And we, at first I didn't even think it was real. Isabel and her friends saw the woman fall and comforted her until first responders arrived. Yeah, she was she would go in and out and then we'd just be like, okay, keep breathing, keep breathing, you're okay. And then we prayed over her and yeah, I think she'll be okay. Witnesses say the woman fell 30 to 50 feet from the cliff to the sand. Lifeguards say she was unresponsive but was breathing when they took her away to the hospital. The second rescue less than two hours later, about a half a mile north. Lifeguards say two men ages 20 and 22 from Los Angeles came down to an area locals call No Surf Beach, known for its dangerous rip currents. The men got caught in a current and started swallowing water. Lifeguards able to respond quickly because they had just finished with the earlier rescue. The rip current is very strong here. If you're not familiar with it, it's going to catch you. All three people rescued were taken to local hospitals. We are still working on getting an update on their condition. Laura Acevedo, 10 News.